Have a nice day, everyone. This video presentation is all about different exogenic processes that happening or evident in our place. But before going further, let me define exogenic processes. Exogenic processes is a geological phenomenon and process that originate in the Earth's external surface. There are three types of exogenic processes, the weathering, erosion, and deposition. Weathering is the interaction between the elements of the atmosphere and the rock exposed of the Earth's surface. An example of weathering is when the roots of the trees penetrate through the layers of rock. This can cause breaking of the surface of rocks into smaller particles. Also, moss or lichen can cause withering. Their roots, which hold water dry longer and block the sunlight, the surface of rocks become easy to break. Erosion. Erosion is another big force that breaks or transports rock particles from one place to another by natural processes. I am going to feature an activity of man which causes the rocks to break down into smaller pieces using heavy equipment. Look at this construction site of a new bridge. Before, there have been big trees and rocks over there. Now, the, the trees are gone and the rocks are broken. The area has been cleared off, all those trees and other plants and also rocks. This is an activity of man that can cause erosion. During heavy rains, the soil and rocks particles will be carried away by the water. This is because there are no more trees to hold the soil. In this area, the trees were cut down. Cutting the trees can cause denudation and erosion. I'm here at this canal to show you that some particles of rock and soil eroded from the hills over there. This is the result of erosion and also this is the example of deposition in which the rock particles and soil are deposited in this area. Deposition is an exogenic process in which sand, trash, and mud are deposited in low area or surface over a period of time. This is happening because of erosion.